you will. The original Behind the Fence expedition took place about one year ago over the summer of 2021. The intent of that mission, which was to actually go behind the fence and investigate Treasure Beach itself, is the holy grail of any behind the fence expedition that's ever been attempted, which has never been accomplished by an outsider. I'm sad to say that the objective of that assignment was never realized. Until now. Imagine, if you will, acquiring some of the most sought-after knowledge in the world by boldly going where few have gone before. This is Behind the Fence 4, Revelation. Ready for some R and R? Treasure Beach, a shell's throw away from the beaches. Find your happy place. Come and discover the quiet solitude and natural beauty of Treasure Beach RV Park and Campground, with over 100 acres of prime vacation campsites nestled on the shores of Asawoman Bay, one mile west of Fenwick Island, and minutes away from Delaware's tax-free outlet shopping or Ocean City's famous attractions. Treasure Beach RV Park and Campground. Find your happy place. So we made it. We actually got behind the fence and into Treasure Beach. Prior to getting in, we had a lot of expectations about what we would actually see behind the fence. And we'd also worked up some plans for how we would get in there. Chip cheese pickle hot sauce. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. What if we ranked it a... It's probably too expensive. How much cardboard do you have? I can get cardboard. I got a cardboard guy. I got no lawnmower. How hard do you think that'd be to make a drone? I can't do it. Do you know anyone who's scuba certified? No. Interviews. interviews. None of those actually work. Our way in, oddly enough, turned out to be us bumping into a couple of old friends on the beach uh, who were staying there and got us in. That's all the more I can say about that. As it turns out, Treasure Beach isn't hiding UFOs, alien bodies, chemtrail canisters, Malaysian Airlines Flight 370, Jimmy Hoffa's body, Elvis, Jim Morrison, Michael Jackson, Andy Kaufman, Kurt Cobain, or Tupac. It's not the location of Cleopatra's tomb or Noah's Ark, probably not the lost city of Atlantis, and certainly not where NASA faked the moon landing. That's out in the desert. There are no secret government test facilities, military bases, or Illuminati rallies. No mermaid meetings, Selbyville Swamp Monster Summits, Chessie Conventions, Dover Demon Gatherings, Sasquatch Symposiums, Jersey Devil Junctures, or Squonk Assemblies. 
But there is something great happening behind the fence at Treasure Beach. A phenomenon foreign to many and only truly experienced by those who seek it out. It's happening all across the 100 plus acres of Treasure Beach. But you won't find it by peeking over the fence or by watching some amazing documentary about it. And in my brief time surviving undercover behind the fence, I learned to embrace it, to become one with it, coexist with it, but certainly not to expose it. Take two. <laughs> well, I haven't been here since I was a child, but it's almost exactly the same. Way. A shell's throw away from the beaches 